college students as a group have been really an understudied and under-focused on population. Uh, when you think about college, you don't think about challenging life events like death losses. It's not really something that comes to mind at all. And in fact, uh, it's such an environment where there's so much fun, there's so much energy, there's so much good that's happening, so much learning and growth. But when you add on that, the experience of a death loss, it's really very, very tough. I mean, the death, of course, is challenging in and of itself, but then you're in an environment where nobody really talks about those kinds of experiences. Uh, so when you do experience it, you know, who are you going to tell? How will you talk about it? Or if you come to college with a death loss, how do you even start those kinds of conversations when you hear people talking about their parents? How do you bring up that, that you know, one of your parents has died? Uh, it's really tough. And what we found was, you know, in working with, with college students and actually doing the research in this area, I knew the students didn't want or in, in many ways didn't need to read a book that I would write. What they really needed was a book where they could hear the voices and the stories of their peers. Uh, just as very much as the title says, they're peers who, who get it. Uh, because it's really difficult to find those individuals. And there are some campuses now who have chapters of, of AMF, which is a national network, uh, to support grieving college students, but there's many campuses who don't. Uh, my co-editor co and co-author, David Fagenbaum, really was the, one of the co-founders of that group, and we, we really came to a point of, you know, what can we do, how can we provide a resource for students who don't have a chapter, who don't have a way uh, to easily connect with peers, and this book really does offer that. Uh, you know, one of the editors who read it very first, you know, she read the book and, and her response to us was, you know, this book is a portable support group. And we said, yes, that is exactly what we were going for. And we really do hope that it can serve that function. It can really be a support uh, and it can really be a help to those students who uh, can't find a way to connect with, with other grieving peers. So we hope it makes a difference.